We will throw the full force of the law at people. And whether you're in this country committing crimes on the streets or committing crimes from further afield online, we will come after you. Talk to me about that because we have seen some high profile figures whipping up the hatred. You talked about it in there with the officers, in fact, about this being added to by online commentary. I mean, I'm even thinking of the likes of Elon Musk getting involved. What are you considering when it comes to dealing with people who are whipping up this kind of behaviour from behind a keyboard and maybe in a different country? Being a keyboard warrior does not make you safe from the law. You can be guilty of offences of, of incitement, of stirring up racial hatred. There are numerous terrorist offences regarding um, uh, the sort of publishing of material. All of those offences are in play if people are provoking hatred and violence on the streets and we will come after those individuals just as we will physically confront on the streets the thugs and the obs who are taking, who are causing the problems for communities. What do you have to say about the Metropolitan Police Commissioner, Sir Mark Rowley's statement? The answers to these questions are very, very simple. The thing is, he is going after those that are, you know, on social media that are voicing their concerns or just talking about what they see that is happening, right? And they are going after these people for saying the things that they see happen. They are not lying. They are just going after them because they saw it. They didn't keep quiet about it. They posted it. And some people even made comments on it. According to a woman who actually went to arrest a man, I actually shared that video. Maybe I've not posted it yet. But very soon you guys will see it. The woman told the man that they are going to arrest him because of his comment. He didn't post a video this time. He only made a comment about the riots or the protest or the gathering or the looting, whatever you want to call it, that is going on in, in the UK. And that is why they, they had to arrest him. It is crazy. And now we see the, the, this police chief coming out and saying, um, don't be a hero behind the keyboard, or if you're a hero behind the keyboard, they're going to come for you. How about you go for those who we see causing problems, who we see stealing, who we see looting, who we see doing all sorts of crazy stuff that are against the law? Why not go after those people? No, they're not, they're not interested in those people. They're interested in you or me talking about it on social media. Even Elon Musk had to ask, is this Britain or the Soviet Union? These days you can't tell the difference. The truth is contagious. Lying is, but the truth is as well. Are we in a climate emergency? But that's what they'd like us to believe.